It started with my friend in Japan. He was a hacker and a pirate, and always left his computer on, along with AIM and MSN. When he logged out of both, I assumed that his computer finally died from overload. It was then I noticed all of his posts on our favorite sites were gone. All his accounts, all his videos, all his comments. <laughs> Sorry, I'm getting ahead of myself. My name is Nathan, and <laughs> I'm a shut-in. I live in North Carolina, and I program for a living. My sister does the shopping for me, and I live in the basement. No windows. That might very well be the only thing that's keeping me safe. I woke up about a month ago at 3 a.m. and sat down on my desk, ready to work a bit, but mostly chat. That's when I noticed Chaos Rita was gone. I don't know his real name, and I don't bother asking. Besides, some spelling issues? So... He was fairly good with English, so I very much enjoyed talking to him. He also knew everything about computers. Stuff I could never imagine possible. That's why I wasn't worried. It was well within his expertise to hack into sites and delete its own posts. I assumed he had gotten sick from the internet. He'd been complaining about it for years. I tried discussing his disappearance with a mutual friend. He seemed confused. Like he was forgetting who Chaos was. This friend was really old. I worried about his mental health. I decided to let it go and talk about sports a bit. By this time, three or four people had stopped logging on. The most unusual thing in the world. People got busy sometimes or just didn't feel like talking. Only their posts disappeared as well. Now, it had been a couple days since Chaos went missing, and I was getting fairly freaked out, so I turned off my computer and watched TV for a while. That's when shit hit the fan. One of the news anchors were gone. The other would look at the spot of her partner just for a while, only to turn to speaking as usual. A local show called The Three Sisters or something was now two sisters, and yes, the third sister was gone. As with the news, Sometimes there would be times where the third sister was important, and for a moment, they seemed to remember, but then they would just keep acting. A cooking show just showed the studio, with no host. Now, I'm a rational man. I was quick to rationalize everything. The news anchor wasn't used to working alone while our partner was sick. And the show with the sisters? It was a part of the plot. I wouldn't know, because I didn't watch it. The cooking show was harder to explain. Perhaps they left the camera running while they had to leave for some reason? And the network guys didn't notice, maybe? Uh, I don't know. I'd calm myself and decided to watch something else. I got a TV guide. My sister had gotten me, and I flipped through it. That's when I noticed the freakiest thing yet. The Two Stooges. I stared blankly at the name. Squished between the old Britcom and one of those shows of how good the 50s were. It was soon to start, so I flipped over to the channel. Sure enough, the title screen, The Two Stooges. Surely it was some Joker ripoff. But no, it started as I remembered it, only with a stooge less. I freaked out and turned off the TV. So, here I am. It's been a month, and around 100 people are missing that I know of. My sister's gone as well. I'm posting this in every site I can, hopefully reaching as many people as possible. If you can notice the people missing as well, my name is Nate Creek, and I live in a small town in North Carolina. Please, PM me as soon as possible. Hey, Bob. Bob, help me out here. The man stared at the computer with furrowing eyebrows. What do you want, Jim? One of the AIs has a glitch. Bob walked over to him, a bored look on his face. How so? I deleted several other AIs and an entertainment pack so I could install the new versions, but this AI didn't delete its memories and is panicking. I thought it was the lack of a support AI because I deleted the system file as well, but the memory logs show it started much sooner. He's been at his computer for hours. What's he doing? Working? Creative writing? It's probably a glitch of some sort. 
Just delete it and clean install with the others. <sighs> I kinda like this one. It's just a program, Jim. It's not like it's anything alive. I guess you're right, Bob. Jim watched the visual representation of Nate Creek type furiously. Jim clicked the AI and chose delete. <laughs>